I sometimes think about the cross and shut my eyes and try to see the cruel nails, the crown of thorns, and Jesus crucified for me. But even could I see him die, I would but see a little part of that great love which, like a fire, is always burning in his heart. You are valuable to God. Don't ever minimize your individuality. The very word individual means you cannot be divided up. You are unique and a composite fashioned in the image of God for a particular purpose. Where do we begin? Tough winters, this storm is hitting hard. This is probably the worst I've seen here. Pretty brutal. Iran's general, Qasem Soleimani. It's like the apocalypse. It's that bad. After Iran made good on its promise, launching a revenge attack on the United States. From the country. From the tragic death of NBA legend Kobe Bryant. For what is right, for what is fair, but what is just? 100 years of history here. What do we want it? Now! What do we want? What do we want it? Now! Is that your Bible? Hey, Bible. Well, for the last 35 years, gone. This looks more like Mars. Facing their worst locust outbreak in 70 years. Second wave. This is a pandemic. Going global, 60 million plus cases, almost 1.5 million deaths. I've developed mild symptoms. French President Emmanuel Macron. President Bolsonaro has. Press Secretary Kayleigh McEnany. Donald Trump tested, tested positive, positive for, for the, the coronavirus. coronavirus. His wife Rita Wilson are both infected. The Chinese whistleblower doctor who told the world about the coronavirus in Wuhan has died. The city supports all essential workers who are showing up every day. I think it's under control. I'll tell you what. How? A thousand Americans are dying a day. They are dying. That's true. It is what it is. More preventative, you know, as a whole, as a country. When I'm president, we will be better prepared, respond better, and recover better. stretching for blocks, forcing people to wait hours to cast their ballots. It could have rain, it could have snow. I would not care. I'm not going anywhere. Is it just me? Or is it getting crazy out there? The year started off great. So with a bang, 2020 begins. Toppers. It's Tania. And I'm Tania. And, and we, we are. are. My head looks big with Wait, this Wait, is that Tylene? Hold on. <laughs> no, watch. Hold on. I feel like they can't see my hair. Anyways, just know I have a ponytail. Okay? Y'all see it. <laughs> um, oh, you do snippy. Ah! Yeah, but it's too cold out for you guys to see anything. <laughs> to see so anything. It. But it's, what day? What day is it? What day is it? What day is it? What day is it? It is day Day one. It's not day one. Day one of what? Oh, day one of Passion Conference. Passion Woo! 2020. We in this. And we are so excited. Yeah. Hey, let's go see the Hey, y'all. We're yeah. going to be in a Mercedes Benz. One time and only first time in Atlanta that they hosted it on New Year's Eve. Going into the new year. And we are going to be worshiping God the whole time. The whole so time. Into the new awesome. year. Starting off the new year right. How yep. about give me some? And our friends are going to be there. And so we're just definitely excited. We definitely are. Yeah. And Charlene's going to be here. Safe travels to ATL, baby. Amen. Keep us in prayer, y'all. Right now we are at QT. Yup. Yeah, but yeah, we are the real cuties. We'll see y'all in passion. Say bye, Charlene. Oh, look, look at this celebrity back here. Hey, she learned well, from the best. She learned from the best. Year. She learned from the best. Be All righty. Um, um, we'll see you at Mercedes Benz Stadium. All right. Peace bye. out. Woo!
I'm going through. So the world can hear the roar of King Jesus. And then coming to the end. What in the world? Gatherings banned. Working from home is the new reality. Are any of y'all wearing pants? Now be honest now. School is closed. This is going to get worse before it gets better. The most human trait is to want to know why. And in a year that tested everyone around the world, why was searched more than ever. I'm just blessed that I, we finally made it to 2021. Where we'll have new goals, a new vision, and we can actually put something on our vision boards this year. And yeah, that's an empty vision board. It's 2020, I had to delete all my dreams. Except for this one! Woo! For this year, I decided to create the series called Tame It. Mainly to focus on understanding my hair. Hey queen! Hey queen! Girl, you've done it again. You are constantly raising the bar for all of us and doing so flawlessly. I hope that when you wake up in the morning and look in the mirror, you see how divine you are. You have dreams to fulfill and promises to yourself that you must keep. I know at times you feel underappreciated and misvalued. Trust me, we've all been there. Don't go seeking perfection. Extend yourself a little grace. Don't be afraid to celebrate the little wins as much as the big ones. You, Miss Thang, are courageous. You are dynamic. You are principled. There's a sweet justice in knowing that the path you are on was designed for you and you alone. Doing right by yourself never goes out of style. Trust me, people are paying attention. You're special and worthy of praise. Don't shy away from it. And you don't have to get your groove back because guess what? You never lost it. It's also important to rest. Make sure your hustle doesn't get in the way of your health. Girl, take care of yourself. And the next time you want to second guess yourself, don't do it. You are needed. You are appreciated. Girl, you make me so proud. And I love you. Remember, you are 100% that queen. Oh, yes. <laughs> I wear my nat hair natural. It is my birthright. My strands, for years I abused and tortured it. My hair is now sober and there's no turning back. You see, I like the way my strands twist, turn, and curl up tight. Rebelling against society's demand that they lay flat without a fight. They have a heritage, a lineage, with souls stirring stories to share. They have earned the right to be free, so go ahead and stare. Society has failed to make them conform despite how hard it tried. My hair is just like me, beautiful, resilient, and full of God. I want to mainly focus on growing as an individual, physically, spiritually, mentally, and doing everything that I couldn't do in 2020. 2020 challenged us. It made us stronger, wiser, and made us learn that we can persevere 
even when things are not looking up. The flame of democracy was lit in this nation a long time ago. And we now know nothing, not even a pandemic or an abuse of power, can extinguish that flame. Now it's time for us to leave our mark. 